Hello everybody, this is me, Swash Dogs, back to you once again. This time I'm going to do Game No. 2 of my run of the family, of family Feud for the NES. I currently have a one game total of $5,000. Hopefully I can add on to that. I'll be the Brian Jr. family. And who am I going to be taking on? I'm going to be taking on the Jackson family. So now, let's play the feud. Now it's the dad's feud. 100 people surveyed, top 7 answers up on the board, here comes the question. Name something that happens at every wedding. Um, cake. Um, I'm going to say cut the cake. All right, let's see if that answer worked. Cut the cake. It's at the bottom of the survey. It's by five people, people, but four answers are more popular. Jackson's is answering, and they're saying, "What if they say it's not there? I'm gonna play. I'm gonna play." Something that happens at every every wedding. Um, I'm gonna say exchange ring. Okay, let's see exchange rings. Dag nabbit, it's my first it's only strike one. Strike one. Um I'm gonna how about renew vows? Let's try renew vows. Renew vows. Shoot! Oh no, two strikes already. Ouch. Jackson family can steal. If I'm, I gotta be careful. Jackson family can steal. Something happens. At, um, I don't know. Married. Get married. If that is up there, I'm still alive. If not, third strike. Married. Get married. No. Shoot. This is a tough one. The Jacks. Uh, hopefully, Jackson family is gonna see it. What are they saying? They're saying, what if it says not there? I steal the points. Five, that was a tough one. What were the other answers? The number one answer was, kiss the bride. Two, cry. Three, toss flowers. Four, throw rice. Six, say vows. Seven, give, give rings. That was the most feud. 100 people so many top four answers up on the board. Here's the question. Name a famous cigar smoker. George Burns. Okay, let's see George Burns. Number one. All right. I'm gonna play. Maybe Castro, Fidel Castro. Let's see. No, it's only the first strike. Strike one. Um. How about Winston Churchill? Oh, let's try Winston Churchill. Let's try Winston Churchill. Oh, yes. All right. 
Fame Seagal, a Seagal. Maybe for the let's try for Doug Castro. Fidel Castro. Dang. Uh oh. Two strikes. Um. What? Uh oh. Two strikes. Um. How about. Groucho. Maybe Groucho Marx? I don't know. If that is up there, I'm still alive. If not, third. Groucho Marx. Yes! All right. One more answer. Um, a famous cigar smoker. Maybe Thomas Jefferson. I don't know. Thomas Jefferson. No. Strike three. Ouch. Let's hope the Jackson family won't steal. What are they saying? There's only one answer left. A famous cigar smoker. What they're saying. What? Why is this not there? I steal again. I steal ninety-four bucks. What were the other ants? What was number four? What was number four? W. C. Fields. Now it's the grand. Dollar values are now doubled. Top five answers up on the board. The question is. Name the best teenage year. Thirteen. Okay, show me thirteen. No! Dag Nebbit's not on the board. What are the Jacksons saying? Not there either. Uh, maybe 17? Let's try 17. It's 7, 7 by 36 people? Two answers are better. Jacksons are answering and they're saying... It's not there. What did he say? It's not there. I'm going to play. The best teenage year. How about 15? Let's try 15. Number 5. 16. Number 1. 19. Oh, yeah. 18. I could probably win. Let's see 18. Yeah, I swept the board and I did. Da -da -da, da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. And I won the game. All right, I did it again. And now I'm off to play Fast Money for another. I won it with 297. And now I'm off for another to play Fast Money again for another $5,000. And I'll. We'll see if I can win that five thousand dollars in fast money coming up after right coming up coming up after the break after this.